Okay, hey guys, uh, it's Carl from CarlsAppT.com again, and I thought I'd make a quick video just to uh, have a quick explanation about what breaks are and what new paragraphs are. So over here, as seen in the first video, we made our HTML document with within which uh, the within the body tags we made the first sentence called "Hello World." Now, if you were to put "Hello World," um, welcome to uh, carlsapti.com. When we save this file, so file save as, oh, file save, and we go to my first page. When we refresh it, we'll come to "Hello World." Welcome to carlsapti.com. Now, let's say I wanted to put this welcome on a new line but not on a new paragraph so to do this all we're simply going to do is first of all we have to indicate that this is its own paragraph so to do this we use the syntax of open angle bracket p and close angle bracket so this shows that this is it this tag p stands for paragraph and to end the paragraph we put it as forward slash p close angle bracket. Now within this, if we want to make a whole completely new paragraph, we will press enter here, make a new tag called P, and then in the first line as well, we have to close this. And this shows that we've got one paragraph here and a second paragraph here. So now we'll go and save this. Uh, control S and then if when I refresh my page I get hello world and then on a separate paragraph completely welcome to carlsapti.com however let's say I didn't want it to be this far down let's say I just wanted it to be a new sentence uh, within this space here so to do this we have to add an empty element called uh, break now to do this all we're going to do is remove the first paragraph so it's back on the same line and we have this here and we're going to add the tab uh, we're going to add the tag called open uh, angle brackets and call this br space forward slash close your angle brackets now what this will do is it will put it directly onto the next line and not two lines down on your web browser so let's save this document and go on to here. Now when I refresh the page you will notice that it will move from here to the space in between. And that's all there is to it.